In this episode, the oldest trick in the book, crap sticks, wasteland runner, the perfect protector. Boy oh boy, it's been a while since our show featured videos about mandrakes annihilating foes flying over. Well, looks like this lesson can be rehearsed a little, since Muhammad just found a guy who can use this knowledge in the future. I mean, hey, it's obvious that the opponent did not fall off a bridge by accident. Nope, he deliberately leaped off after our hero. You know what they say, if they can't learn from someone else's mistakes, they can always learn from their own. For now, let's transfer 1,000 gold to our glorious teacher. Good one. The next contestant has built a particular character from a famous cartoon show. This vehicle looks way cool, I guess nobody would argue with that, but its potential combat performance is not so evident. Let's see if DG Nexa can make us change our minds with this video. 1000 gold coming right up. Usually races are won by hovers or wheel rides. Track machines just can't cut it, whereas platforms and legs are just odd. The nature knows many creatures that can outrun vehicles, but Mother Nature never had rocket boosters. And Ray does, though, and he's not afraid to use them. The result of this work is a racing walker that you're looking at right now. To be honest, this thing scares me the way it moves, but damn, it's fast. That's a great build, man. And Ray, here's your goal. Enjoy it. We all know that elevated positions are better in any kind of combat situation. But what do you do when there's just a single hill next to the zone you must defend and any close combat ride can just drive up there and take you down? Mechanic shows some great tactical thinking climbing the steep rock face using a harpoon. Now all his enemies are below him and wide open for attacks at their vulnerable roofs, while return fire is pretty light, since most vehicles cannot elevate their weapons high enough. Once the threat was cut to size, the cunning spider lowers himself down on the ground to finish off the opposition. What a battle! Mechanic, good job. Please, have this goal. Now it's time to pick the best comet of the past week. Pierre Trenti Du says, The fauna of the wastes also includes dragons. Humans really have to worry in this region. Please respond to your original comment with your in-game nickname and email address so we can send you your prize. Please be advised that the prize may take up to 5 business days to be added to your in-game account. Thank you for watching this episode. Okay, let's recap the three simple steps on how to submit your video to Crossout Shell. Step 1. Record and put together a video. Attention! The submitted video must be made by you, must be published for the first time, must have public access for viewers, and must not violate any copyright laws. Step 2. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the like button below this video. Step 3. Upload your video to YouTube and send us a direct link to Crossout Show at Gaijin.ru. The covering email should contain the desired category for your video, your in-game nickname, and the email address registered with your game account, so we can send you the reward should your submission win. Every week, four submissions will win 1,000 gold. We will also be awarding the best comment of the week with 300 gold. So, get your engines revving, make some content, send it to us, or simply watch and comment. Either way, we got plenty of gold to go around. See you in the week.